go pretty well this afternoon. What? How many runs was that? That was my third. We started pretty early. That's pretty good. I know some of the other trails got started late, so that's Just remind your crew that they're here to give the PCs a good fight, not to steamroll them. Yeah, yeah, I know. Make sure there's enough people to drag the bodies back. Don't kill all of them. I got this. I got this. Not quite what I meant, but... About that assassination last night. <laughs> no, that was a mistake. Some noob got back into some razor wire while finding a goblin. That's all it was. Uh-huh. Don't you have somewhere to be right now? Don't we both have somewhere to be right now? Look, just remind your crew to take it easy. Yeah, yeah. And you got that thing fixed with your plot, right? I'll take it care of. Good. At least one less thing to worry about. Well, after the newly gathered green skin was destroyed, you will go ahead and be right next to the newly appointed warlord. He will not leave his sight. Think of it as you get to, uh, you know, advise him all his defenses. I don't really think it's that big a deal. I mean, the green skins, we never seem to have trouble fighting them. And if we have a problem and one of us ends up dead, Rash will fix it. No. When enough of them who are older on the town to kill us, then to go around and destroy the villages we're protecting, kill the commoners? No, oh, no, not the commoners. The commoners are actually quite important. They farm our lands, give us the material we need. They go into the mines, give us all the ritual power. You know what? We should go ahead and have a scouting party. Uh, you know, see the land, see the villages, see what they do. Plus, they can use probably a couple of drives to spy. Alright, that, that doesn't seem like it's that bad of an idea. I, I guess I could do that. Good. Two pair with tens. I win again. Ha! Ah, let me show you how a real warlord handles the situation. How about the full house? Queens over tens. Sure. Well, that's what I thought. That's great and all. However, a true lore lord knows to hold a pair of aces and three kings. I mean, wouldn't want someone on record who had their record tarnished by charges run on the record. Looks like you're carrying my shield again, Susan. <laughs> Poor Susie. Oh, the baby? Hey, Joe. Oh, hey, Melissa, what's up? Um... Weren't you supposed to go back in town with Sid? Yeah, I kind of forgot my weapon. Oh, all right, um, yeah, that happens. Go I actually, on. I had a question. Sure. You and, and Bright have to see a lot, right? Yeah, yeah, we have. Well, I, I just had a couple questions. Like, I know PCs have some stuff they have to follow, but what about NPCs? Do they have, like, rules or...? Well, the basic, the difference between a PC and an NPC is that NPCs can't lie. They can't lie. They, everything they at say... All? No, at all. Everything they say has to be, has to be taken as truth. And everything that's written for them has to be taken as true. So they can't run around saying they own like a dragon farm because, you know, that's not cool. And people don't ride around dragons, so it doesn't make any sense. Okay, yeah, right. But yeah, that's, that's fine. Okay. Is there anything else you needed? Actually, you remember when Sid mentioned the scouting party? Yeah. Would, would you like. Yes. Really? Yes. All that. You kidding me? Uh, oh, that, yeah. Okay, that's amazing. Yeah. All right, all right. I'll um, see you in town. Yeah, yeah. So I'll be the rest of my gear. Okay. Cool. See you later. Bye. 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 Oh, God. I remember those days. <laughs> oh, noobs. God, I remember those days. That was so funny. Wear it. Mother. Fighting match this time, though. Ah. Sorry! My bad!